Okay, I've taken video of this before, but I just wanted to do an updated one where I actually have a, include a fan in there. It's a 24 volt fan to push air out and keep the thing cool. Uh, I have no overheating problems anymore. Two regular uh, wheelchair battery motors that came with me, like 15 years old at this point. So I can I have to cut the lawn in portions. I can do the backyard, then the front yard, and the hill. Um, big ATV tires. Some. Uh, wheel casters from Harbor Freight. I took one of the front wheels from the wheelchair motor and put it there so it wouldn't rub against the wall if I do one side. I mounted the lawnmower sideways and I can put the bagger on there as well and I'll get it started and show a demo. Okay, get it to get it started, turn on the remote, make sure the light's green on the back, then put the switch under here. It's just a light switch. Here, turn on. The voltage. I can also keep track of the amount of amps of pulling, watts, and total milliamps hours used. So here we go. Next step. Go down here, prime it, just like a normal mower. I wrap the extra cord around the handle. I'm gonna move it back a little bit to make it easier for me to. To start it. There we go. Alright, there we go. Okay, I started it up. I have it working. Uh, I have it set on the highest setting. There's a crude way of adjusting the, the height right here. Built, built in from what I had before, and I'm grabbing it with my other hand. So, here we go. So this is grabbing it one hand. As long as the grass isn't wet, it handles the hill just fine. So that's it.